you, my bank account is screaming. Hi Disney friends, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a extremely long time since I filmed a video for you all, but I'm back now and I'm back with a bit of a huge haul. Um, yeah, I bought quite a lot of stuff. This is post lockdown, so you know. Haven't been shopping for quite a while, so um, I thought I'd just jump on here and show you everything I got. So, without further ado, let's get on into the video. Okay, so what do we start with? Also, don't mind the fan in the background. It gets really hot in my room, so let's just carry on. Oh, where to start? Hmm, maybe Primark? Let's start with Primark. Okay. Perfect. Okay, so Primark, I adore Primark, um, so I may have spent just a little bit too much in there. So the first thing I bought and I picked up was this gorgeous stitch throw. It's just got stitch and angel and it's got some leaves. Love it, it's so cute, so soft, so cosy. Um, so yeah, I got this one. Uh, this was £6 and yeah, so that's the, uh, the design, that's what it looks like when you open it all out. I can't wait to use this. So excited for this one. Um, okay. Next thing that I got from Primark was this set of two scrunchies. So one just has the mini bow and then you get a Mickey one as well. And I couldn't pass these up because these are incredibly adorable. And these were three pounds. Okay. So I've got in here, picked up some hair bands I'm in a little Ziploc bag because I already used two of them and I didn't want to lose the rest um, because that's become, you know, you find these things everywhere, they, they just get lost so easily. I mean, they're so, I don't know. Am I the only one that has this problem? Please tell me I'm not. <laughs> um, okay, so that was the first bag of Primark things. Um, the second bag of Primark things, just dig around here, I'm just going to pull things out. Okay, so this one, I just picked up a pair of mum shorts, they're, they fit really nicely, um, they're undone because I have actually tried them on now, because um, obviously in stores at the moment you aren't allowed to try things on, so you do have to bring them home, but you can always return, um, so yeah, these were £10 and I thought they were a really nice shade, they're a really good quality denim as well, and um, I just really like those, so yeah, pick those up. Um, and then the next, the next thing I picked up were these pink, pinky, ready colour shorts and it's got a really nice elasticated waistband at the top and then they're a really nice length. I've got pockets so that's always a win and uh, those were £4. That's those. Um, and then... I found this beautiful Lilo and Stitch t-shirt so it's just the I have to cover my face you can't see me it's just it's very creased I know uh, it's not been out of the bag I'm saving it for holiday um so yeah so there's the little outline of Stitch there and um it's just made up of the words Ohana means family and family means no one gets left behind or forgotten yeah i just thought that was really cute and i got it in a bit of an oversized shirt so i could wear it with a pair of um cycling shorts maybe it was like a t-shirt dress type thing um and then i had to get this when i saw it obviously oh i forgot to tell you the price of the other one didn't i um that one was seven pounds and then i got this one baby yoda shirt super cute isn't he she's got baby Yoda on the front again really creased they've not been out of the bag I'm very sorry and then on the arm it just says Star Wars and then that one was eight pounds anything else in here got some socks essentials let's put that back in the bag okay third Primark bag and the final Primark bag, and then we'll move on to some other things. Okay, so I bought a stitch pencil case. This was £2.50. 
I got a set of three um, stitch notebooks. They come in really handy for work um, because I take a lot of notes, otherwise I will forget everything. Um, so yeah, those were two pounds and I just really love the design. Obviously, you know I adore stitch, so they were a must. And then last bit of stationery. Actually, no, that's a lie. There's some pens in here. Um, I got this cute notebook. It's got little dividers at the top. But again, it just says weird but cute. Got stitch on the front, and it's just a lined notebook. And, and the, obviously, the dividers have got little designs too. So yeah, pick that up. And then I, I tried to open these, so I'm sorry about the, the box. Um, so next thing, uh, these two pens. We've got a mint green one with a mini on, and then just a white one with Mickey head, and then Mickey Mouse on top. Um, I have to carry pens around with me at work because pens are just like gold dust at my workplace so make sure I have my own because then I know these are mine <laughs> um, so yeah so those were £2 and then I got more socks and then the last thing I got from Primark was this nightshirt how cute is this we've got Lilo and Stitch on the little hammock there and I just love the colour, it's so bright. Again, crinkled because it's in, been in the bag. I'm very sorry. It's very messy. <laughs> and that was £6. So, and okay, so that's just Primark. Out of the way. Okay. So the next thing I'm going to show you is actually already on my Pandora bracelet. Um, so I went shopping with my friend Izzy and we obviously had to go into Pandora because I have a bit of an addiction. <laughs> um, so I've been seeing obviously around on Instagram the new up charm had been you know floating around as it were and um, I really really had to get it so um yeah, I treated myself to that. It's just this one here. I really don't know if it's going to focus. Probably not, to be honest. Let's try it. I'll, I'll hold it here. You can kind of see it. There we go. So it's just got the balloons and then the little house at the bottom. And then on the front of the charm, it does say, but I don't think you're going to be able to see it does say adventure is out there which I thought was a really cute touch so obviously I had to get that one and that one was £45 okay so next shop what should we go with let's go with Uniqlo actually so I went into Uniqlo on two occasions because I went shopping with my friend Izzy and then I went shopping with my fiance Liam um, and I took a trip Uniqlo. One of the shirts I can't actually show you because I've already worn it, but I got um, a shirt with the Pokemon Eevee on the front of it, so it was part of their Pokemon collection. Um, so yeah, I got that. And then the next one, this was actually in their sale, I believe I paid £7.90 for this one, and I thought it was really cool. So it's in the, actually in the men's section of Uniqlo, but you know, t-shirt's a t-shirt. So yeah, <laughs> got it's got like the little Pixar sign on it. I don't know if you're going to be able to see it because the lighting is messing around with me right now. But anyway, so the pig is Woody. And then we have, oh, there we go. And then we have the I, which is Buzz. Sully, which is the X. Mike Wazowski, which is the A. And then we have Lightning McQueen as the R. And I thought it was a really simple, cute t-shirt. So obviously I had to get that one. Then... The next one I picked up, now I'm a massive Billie Eilish fan, so when Uniqlo brought out a Billie Eilish collection, you know I had to get it, obviously. So I already had two of those shirts, I got one for my birthday and then the other one I picked up for myself. And then this one I came across while I was in the, the store and um, I had to get it. It's just got her logo on the front and it's got flowers and some mushrooms and I thought it was really cool so I got that and then that one was £12.90 and then I got another Billie Eilish t-shirt which is just this one here 
I don't know how much of this design you can be able to see. It's like quite light. Obviously, you can see the green logo in the middle. Um, and it's just got like flowers and smiling flowers and things. And I thought it was really nice. So I got that one as well. And that one was also £12.90. Um, so, yeah. So that's what I got from Uniqlo. Okay. Next, I'm going to go with HMV. So, HMV, I got two vinyls. Um, the first one I picked up was the new All Time Low album. Um, really, really love All Time Low. And um, I was so excited when I found the picture disc. Obviously, I had to get this one. I love them. Um, and that one was twenty three ninety nine. And then this is the other one I got. <laughs> Frozen Two. I love, absolutely adore the soundtrack to Frozen Two. So I just had to get this one and pick it up. This one I think was twenty two ninety nine, and I really, really wanted the blue limited edition disc from HMV. I was so happy um, when I found it. So if I just take it out, I'll just show you. It's absolutely stunning. It's just got Elsa on this side and then we've got Anna on this side. So yeah, I'm so happy that I was able to find that. Add to my collection of vinyls. I'm actually using my record player it's holding you up right now, to be honest. It's right it's right behind you. <laughs> um, okay, so that's what I got from HMV. Okay, let's put that back in. Okay, what next? Right. The next shop I went to was a Victoria's Secret Pink. They actually had a sale on. So she did that. Okay, so first thing I picked up was this Victoria's Secret Pure Seduction Fragrance Mist. It smells absolutely delightful. My friend Izzy actually uh, wore this first and I was like, what is that? It smells great, what is it? <laughs> and um, yeah, so I went and picked myself one of those up. And then I did get another spray. I picked up a refill for my... Victoria's Secret bombshell because I'm actually running really really low and it's one of my favourite scents it's the nicest thing ever and I really really love it oh my god I'll find it I'll just put some on there actually oh, I don't know what that noise was I'm very sorry I'm very hyper trying to get this done <laughs> um okay so the next thing these are in the sale I believe where's the tag um, these were £15, knocked down to £7.99, and they are just basically some pyjama shorts with peaches on it. What more can I see? Um, next thing I picked up was, it was the same kind of pyjama shorts style, but they have watermelons on it. These ones were full price, but I couldn't just leave them in the shop. So these were £15, but they were just really cute and really well made, obviously, for Victoria's Secret Pink. Everything is high quality. Um, got watermelons and then they're just a nice blue shade. And then this is the other thing. This was £15 as well. Again, full price, but I got it to go with the shorts. It's just a really basic, uh, like, teal, bluey coloured top. And I think, yeah, that's everything from Victoria's Secret and Pink. So I'm just going to move that back. And then we are on to the last few things, which are from my absolute love. Obviously, we know here on the channel that I am JDX Disney over on Instagram. So it wouldn't be right if I didn't have anything from the Disney shop to show you. So here we go. Let's go. Okay, so from the shop in Blue Water, I picked up this little plant pot little art plant pot look at the little balloons i just couldn't leave it in the shop i'm sure you can see why it's just so cute i love it i love up and that was 10 pound 95 i'll wrap that back up don't want it to get destroyed 
I need to find a place for all these things. Um, okay, then the next thing I picked up was the Angels Mini Cuddlies Angel to go with the stitch one that I have up on my shelf. She's going to look really cute with him. I can't wait to put her with him. And that one was £8.95. And then I got a mug in their sale. Um, so I just put it in this box because I didn't want it to get broken. Um, this this is from the Stratford store in London in Westfields I believe it's called the shopping centre um, so yeah I got this mug it just says made in the 90s and then it has Slinky, Rex, one of the aliens another alien down there and on the back we've got Woody, Jesse and a bunch more aliens and I just thought it was really nice and it was in the sale I think it was £4.50 I think I, yeah so it was £4.50 in their sale, originally £9, and I had to get it because made in the 90s and Toy Story. Mm, do I need to say any more? No, I think so. Okay, I found the box. And then. Now, this book, when it came out, it sold out so quickly, I was gutted that I couldn't get it. Um, I thought that it would be absolutely perfect for my uh, mine and Liam's first ever trip to Disneyland Paris. I was going to put our first pictures from Disneyland Paris in it and it was going to be great. And I was so upset when I couldn't find it. Um, it sold out everywhere. But when I went into Stratford on Thursday, I believe, they had the Cinderella one, they had the Snow White one, and then right at the very bottom, there she was. <laughs> The adventure book and oh my god when i tell you this thing is so well made it's literally an exact i mean it's meant to be an exact replica but it's it's embroidered it's like leathery it's got the little tie and then when you open it up you've got the first few pages like it is exactly in the film and it's literally like it's just been stuck in the sellotape it's great it, it is so cute i love it i mean the detail it's ridiculous and then like on the just the note uh, book pages you've got Kevin in the corner down there but if you can see him properly and you've got the little house with the balloons at the top and I'm just gonna show you the back because it's one of my favorite pages in the book was this this is the cutest thing ever and I'm so happy I was able to find it. This is one of or the favourite thing that I picked up in this haul and I'm so oh I can't express how happy I am to have this in my possession now. So yeah. Okay, so the last that was all from the Disney store and the last few things now. Um I went into Kiko. Oh wait no I lied. One more thing from the Disney store. I picked up a hand sanitizer. It's got Queen Elsa on the front there. And it smells like coconut. Adore coconut. Um, okay, so moving on. I went to Kiko Milano, the store in Stratford. I picked up three lip glosses. Um, so I got shade number five, which is just a pink sparkly shade there. And then I got shade number 17. Which is another sparkly one, but it's like a, a darker darker kind of shade and then I just picked up like a normal normal clear clear gloss because you can't go wrong with clear gloss so yeah those are those three and now the very last thing that I got actually came today um if you know me you know I've been looking for Bruni um from Frozen 2 um pop vinyl for the longest time and I looked on Amazon yesterday and it finally came back into stock and now I have him here and I'm so extremely excited because um, I was thinking on my shelf I have four rows of pop vinyls and I was thinking of taking my Toy Story one out and I think I'm going to have my frozen pop vinyls out for a little while because for my birthday my sister actually got me the Olaf with Bruni on his head and then my friend Izzy got me Elsa, yeah she got me Elsa um, so I was going to pop them on the shelf and I can show you that at some point if you'd like just let me know um so yeah guys that is absolutely everything <laughs>